Hi guys, it's Varun here from 499. Here we are at the Mobile World Congress and here I have in my hand the Xiaomi Mi 5, which is uh, Xiaomi's flagship for 2016. So here's the white variant of the device. You must have seen our hands on with the black variant. Um, there are actually three variants of the Xiaomi Mi 5 if you look into the specs. So Xiaomi announced the Mi 5 Pro, which is a top end variant, uh, and the Xiaomi Mi 5 64 GB, which is a mid variant. And there's also Xiaomi Mi 5 32 gig gigabyte, which is the low-end version. So there's a, actually a price difference between all these models. So let's actually see in this video what's actually different between the Xiaomi Mi 5 Pro, the Xiaomi Mi 5 64 gigabyte, and the Xiaomi Mi 5 32 gigabyte. Uh, there's also a lot of difference in the specs and also how it looks like. For instance, the Xiaomi Mi 5 uh, 6 Pro packs 120 gigs of storage and also a ceramic back. Uh, unlike the glass back on the uh, 64 gigabyte and 32 gigabyte models, also there's a lot of RAM difference and processor uh, speed difference as well. The main difference being the price and the storage. So let's actually go and see what's actually different between the three versions. So here we are at uh, Mobile World Congress, and this is the Xiaomi Mi 5. So what's actually different between the Xiaomi Mi 5 Pro, the Xiaomi Mi 5 64 gigabyte, and the Xiaomi Mi 5 32 gigabyte? So Here's what's different. So first up, the price. So the Xiaomi Mi 5 Pro comes at 2699 RMB. Uh, for that price, you get a Snapdragon 820 processor clocked at 2.15 GHz, and also a 3D ceramic back cover on the back. So it feels a lot similar to the glass, but Xiaomi claims that it's actually much more robust and can take uh, some amount of water resistance and all that stuff. So that's some, I actually liked it because it has, it's better fingerprint resistant than the glass. So I like the uh, Xiaomi Mi 5 Pro. So the Xiaomi Mi 5 64 gigabyte model is actually a little cheaper, about 400 RMB cheaper. So it's about 2299 RMB and it has a 3D uh, glass back cover, same on the Xiaomi Mi Note Pro. And it also has the same Snapdragon 820 processor and it's clocked at the same speed of 2.15 GHz like on the Mi 5 Pro. So not much difference there. But what's different is the storage. You get only 64 gigabytes, whereas you get 128 gigabytes on the top end model of the Mi 5 Pro. So what's the lowest end variant of the Mi 5 is the Mi 5 32 gigabyte model, which is probably the one which might come to India at some point. So that's priced at RMB 1999 or 2000 RMB. You have only 32 gigs of storage and it's clocked at, the processor on the phone is clocked at uh, 1.8 gigahertz, the Snapdragon 820, the same processor, but uh, clocked at 1.8 gigahertz, the same 3D glass back cover as on the Mi Note Pro and the Mi 5. Uh, uh, 64 gigabyte. What's also different is that the uh, other than the Mi 5 Pro, both the other devices pack only 3 gigabytes of RAM, uh, whereas the Mi 5 Pro packs 4 gigabytes of RAM. So that's what is different, and they all pretty much look the same, very hard to find out. And also, there's a 10 gram weight difference between the Mi 5 Pro and the Mi 5. I couldn't really figure it out. So it's pretty much the same device, uh, except for the specs. If you ask me which device to go for, I would probably go for the Mi 5 Pro because it just packs the best. Uh, features and you don't have a memory card slot in this phone, so 100 gigabyte makes a lot of sense to invest in. And yes, so it's not a much difference in terms of the uh, dollar pricing. So that's the Xiaomi Mi 5 Pro, the Mi 5 64 gigabyte, and the Mi 5 32 gigabyte.